Hi, I'm Paula Shaw, and it's time for another episode of Saying the Right Thing When You Don't Know What to Say, my latest book available on Amazon. So, what do you say when your child comes home from school, your young child, and says a swear word that you can't believe they said. Do you give them a slap and say that's terrible? Do you wash their mouth out with soap? Well, that used to happen when I was a kid. But I think most of us these days know that's not the way to handle the situation. But how do you handle it? What is the right thing to say? Because you do want your child to know that that word's not acceptable. And you do want your child to know the right course of action in the future. And you want them to know that that word does not make you happy. But how do you go about doing that without having the child feel that they are the worst person who ever lived? Or that they're terribly fearful that they're going to be punished? So my suggestion is that if something like that happens, instead of getting angry or um, rushing right to punishment, go to calm, to curious, and clear. So if you're calm, take a deep breath, and then ask the child, where did you hear that word? Do you know what that word means? Why did you say it? So get some information about what's behind this. They might not even have any idea what that word means. They might have heard somebody say it at school and the kids laughed or it got a reaction and they thought that was kind of cool. So they want to try it for you. So if we rush to being angry at them and scolding them and telling them they're bad when they don't even really know what they did, then we're going in the totally wrong direction. So remember, if your child comes home and says a swear word, they might even think it's funny. They may have no idea that it's offensive. So come first from your unconditional love for them. And remember to be calm, be curious, be clear, and maybe throw in be creative in how you handle the situation so that your child knows that's not something that you want to hear again, but it in no way impacts how much you love them and how happy you are that they're yours. All right. Thanks for joining me. See you again soon. We're saying the right thing when you don't know what to say.